I'll kill Grave Astra to give you this. <gasps> hey, everybody. No, it's Mom Judy. Hello. Welcome to our reaction channel. Today we are continuing <coughs> with our Jessica Jones reactions. We're season one, episode eight, aka WWJD. What would JD? No, what would Jessica do? Maybe, I don't know. Uh, before I begin, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. And if you want to watch our full-length reaction to any of our Jessica Jones reactions, you can find them on my Patreon. And I also have another YouTube channel where I do a daily vlog now. I'll link to in the description box. And I'm selling some merch, you guys. Because I swear I'm sober. Oh, that poor Jessica. <laughs> Jessica can't say she's sober. No. She, she drinks. Well, no, granted, Jessica could drink a lot and probably still stay sober. Right. She drinks so much. So, hey. Yeah, so this is, we're selling this now. It should be, you know, linked to the store in the description box if you're interested in this. And, you know, it comes in many different sizes and colors and, you know, hoodies and t shirts and all that good stuff. So, it's good. I'll put it over here right now. I won't blatantly show it off every single episode. I'll be good. So, okay, dokie. Last episode, right, Jessica had to go live with Kilgrave now. Mmm. They show yourself thrown in prison, but that didn't work. No. <laughs> because he just compelled everybody to mm -hmm. forget about it. That's really the biggest thing. Yeah. So let's get into it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, but Simpson, he, he saw it. Mmm. He didn't tell Trish that he's been watching. No, Kilgrave moved Kilgrave. into somebody's house. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, her family must die, and that's where she has to go live with mm. Trish and them, you know? Welcome home, Jessica Jones. <laughs> it's like, oh, God. His bodyguard. My home never had an armed guard. Well, that's Hank. Say hi, Hank. Hi, Hank. <laughs> I slip sometimes. I was serious when I said I wanted you to choose. Oh my god. Oh my god. But trust is a two way street. Like, does he really think. Look for any sharps or drugs. I knew it wasn't out of love. I'm not delusional. <laughs> optimistic. <laughs> I'll show you around. Did we ever do that in our house? I'm on a tradition by families everywhere. Not us, apparently. <laughs> Not mine, of course. My parents wouldn't dare let their walls be defaced. When we were together, I asked what your happiest memories were. Mm. You said? Home. Home. Yeah, but dude, way to kind of ruin her home for her. Right. Her actual happy memories. Laurent Bouchard. Alba Ramirez. I will not stay in a house with slaves. Oh, now you're just being sanctimonious. Tell Jessica whether or not you are happy with your salary. Absolutely. I make twice as much as my last job, from which I was fired due to a drinking problem. See? Some of us give uh, people a second chance. That's all. You may leave. Sorry, doesn't have to be constantly mind control then. I'm tired. Your room awaits. Oh, God. Just imagine a little 14 year old you peeping in on the neighbors. <laughs> Would you want to invite her up? How do I know that this is not like last time? When he had you acting like everything was well. Ah. Because Kilgrave is a psychotic, repulsive, wasted <laughs> human being. If I were under his control, he would never let me say that. Ah. Ah. You'll need money. Oh, wow, dang. Like I said, that doesn't seem like Jessica's uh -uh. style. Should have given her a black pantsuit or something. Right? <laughs> Not even, just give her Cat a... Cat suit. Yeah, or just give her a leather jacket. Girl, you need food, though. You gotta keep your strength, though. Right? No dress? Purple's not really my color. That's what we said. Oh, <laughs> my God. Yeah, she needs your t-shirt. I know. Jessica's like, I swear I'm sober. All <laughs> right. Another bottle, please. Suddenly it ended roughly. Oh my god. You call making me murder a woman right? ending roughly? That was no, terrible. No, no, let's be clear. I did not tell you to kill Reva. What? what? If you remember, I said take care of her. 
Don't kill her. You chose to punch her. You goddamn son of a bitch. Oh. 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 I knew you had a safeguard in place. Ah, uh -huh. testing boundaries, eh? Smart. I didn't see that coming. Oh! Oh, shit. What the hell are you doing? Get out of here. You're under his control. No, I'm not. Is everything all right up there? Huh? I tripped. I'm drunk. Just stay out of my shit. Put a bomb in the basement to kill that asshole. Oh, my God. Shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> My lucky guess is that it was Trisha's missing officer Simpson. He would have killed sweet little Alva and Laurent too. You've killed more people as an afterthought. <laughs> I've never killed anyone. You use your powers to compel murder. Oh, mm -hmm. Tomato, tomato. What matters is you saved my life. Oh my God. She didn't do it for you. You do care for me. She did it so you can get your confession. I just can't handle another death on my conscience. Oh. Oh. Mom. Oh. It's time to get going, sweetie. We don't oh. have life was for you, Jesse. <gasps> Philip's right. Oh, I wonder what happened. You really are a screw up. Make it oh. right, Jesse. Make it goddamn right. I wonder, right. How, they, I wonder how they died. Yeah, I don't know. And returning home. Oh, no. Such no. a handsome husband. No, we're Ew, not. Ew, no. Intrigued. Oh, my God. I'd love to God. hear all about my little Jesse. <laughs> I was there God, when the parents brought her home from the hospital. Really? I can't get her to wear a dress for the life of me. <laughs> I'll wear one to your funeral. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh. I mean, just the very next day, I mean, there you are, leaving for a vacation. Please, Please stop. Right? I knew something terrible was going to happen. Please, stop. And why would you say such a horrible thing? It makes me feel important. Isn't that a shitty thing to do? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it Say is. It. Yes, it is. We used to do a lot more than just touch hands. Oh, my God. Yeah. It's called rape. What? Which part of staying in five-star hotels... Oh, my God. ...eating in all the best places, doing whatever the hell you wanted is rape? The part it's where rape. I didn't want to do any of it. I didn't have this. A home, loving parents, a family. Oh, boohoo. Sorry you for blame you, okay. bad parenting? <laughs> My home. Oh, God. Oh, they did tests on him. And my personal favorite cerebral spinal fluid yeah. extractions. Yeah. Why would they do that? Still uh. some. Yeah. <laughs> this will all be over before you know it. Don't move. Don't move. I'll tell you when. That's what you wanted from Reva. It was the only evidence left of how I was made. Hmm. How'd Reva have it? Oh, I know where it was. So no one knows you exist except your parents. All the shit that you do is because nobody ever taught you how to be good. <laughs> I truly hope you're not laughing at me, Jessica. Oh, I no, was, no, sorry. I'm just thinking. <laughs> She's gonna try and make him maybe do some good? It is mind control. Let me prove that he has it in front of witnesses. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Don't tell anyone we were here. Go now. Well, now that's out of the way. Put the barrel of the no! gun into your mouth. You can't kill him. And what would Jessica do? Make him turn himself over to the police. How many more lives do you think I'd have to save to get back to? <laughs> Saving someone doesn't mean unkilling mm -hmm. someone else. You caught it, Spaz. Jessica, why did Run! you? Oh! Oh! Uh. <laughs> oh my God! That's terrible. No, oh, those poor people. I know. They were so bad. Wipe your faces. I make myself presentable. Oh. What do you have to stand in it? Yeah, they, I don't even think they could blink. Maybe about you and me. Maybe we can balance the scales a bit. Yeah. <laughs> well, we should certainly try. It's not doing it for you, Kobe. Right? It for if this hero everyone thing else. doesn't pan out, I am out of here. 
Do they need to meet with us? Yes. First step in heroism, don't be a prick. Right? <laughs> oh my god. That's gonna kill him. Again. That might be better, yeah. Oh, it's like torture. Right? That's so satisfying. Oh. Bravo, what's the matter? Oh. 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 This is what Jessica would do. Oh. So dark. I don't know what she's looking at. Oh! Yep. Don't move. Let him go. <sighs> what the hell was that? Nah! Did she just fly? That's impossible. No, she just jumped really high. Shit. I'll kill Grave asked me to give you this. <gasps> oh, the bomb. No! Oh. Oh, shit. Yeah, he couldn't change his ways, could he? Bl little neighbor lady. I can't tell. Yeah, I couldn't tell Glish got hurt either. Discussion time. Oh my god. So Jessica ended up... I'm assuming she stuck him with the soup. Yeah, soup fentanyl or whatever. And she took him. And jumped high somewhere. Yeah. And that little neighbor lady, she, Koger gave her the bomb. Yeah. And, I mean, pro he probably did that in case Jessica tried something like this. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, but man, Jessica had Kilgrave be a hero for a moment. I know. And then she asked Trish, what should I do? Now, I don't know if she, where she's taking him, what she's going to do with to him. To that safe house thing that they'd set up, maybe? I figured. Yeah. But man, I know. There was a part of me that, like, wanted to see... Jessica tried to make Kograve do good things just because I wanted to see if <laughs> it tortured him to do it. I know. Um, yeah. And um, that poor Alva and Laurent. Oh, yeah. I think they're just, they're, she didn't kill him. No, I bet I meant. Oh, because of Kilgrave. Yeah. yeah. I know, yeah. Well, Jessica wouldn't kill innocent people. No, I meant poor them because oh, was I know. torturing them I know. the entire episode. I know when he's always saying to Jessica, oh, you, you hear of your own free will, but is she, yeah, she isn't really. Not when you have the threat of other people dying on your hands, if you don't do what he says, that's, right. not, that's not actually free will. No, it's still not. I mean, he's not mind controlling her, but that's about it. And then, oh my God. So we learned, well, one, we learned more about Jessica's family. They died in a car crash. Yeah. And then Kill gave his family, his parents, did tests on him. Yeah. So he made it sound like they gave him that ability because they did tests on him. Yeah, or something. But injected, then why, why probably they, injected him with stuff. And, but then why were they doing tests on him to begin with? Because they were scientists and they were uh, just weirdo people. And they were, okay. So then they gave him his abilities. And, and Kill Graves all like, oh, my life I'm, you know, so it feels bad for me because I never know if I tell someone to do something. Right. It's my powers, or if they choose to, and I'm like, Kilgrave, no, yeah, but you're terrible. Right. Like a crap, like Jessica was saying, a crappy childhood doesn't excuse bad right. behavior. Right, right. You know, especially when you're like, I mean, he has, well, I mean, granted, but the way, okay, the fact that he obviously didn't have, like, parents' love. Right. It's understandable why he doesn't have much empathy, and why I don't think he understands what the right thing right. to do is, because he hasn't had the best examples in his life. So that is true. And it wasn't his fault that that happened to him as a kid. Right. But as a grown up, as a grown adult, he should know better. Yeah. And, um, and he doesn't know better. <sighs> and, you know. Yeah. Let's just say before he became Kilgrave, well, we, learned, we knew his name was Kevin. But before he became Kilgrave, now, okay, is that his last name or a name you picked? I have no idea. But before he became Kilgrave, though, think about it. Dude should have been in therapy to get help. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. So that way he didn't become what he is now. Just saying, therapy, man. therapy. Um, yeah. Yeah, and then Kilgrave was all like, oh, you know, we were together, Jessica. She's like, do you raised me? And he's like, what is it? Yeah. Like, Jesus. He's like, oh, you know, I took you everywhere you wanted to go. Dude, you fucking mind control her. Right. Like, obviously, that's not anyone, no one gives their consent to be mind controlled. Right. So, Kilgrave is a lost cause. But yeah, but, but was Jessica seriously considering 
wanting him to be like a hero when she went to Trish, or was she just doing that to do that? No, she probably was trying to debate on it. Yeah. And then she was like, screw it. Yeah. <laughs> He's evil. We gotta get rid of him. But she knew she's been recording him, and so she needs to prove what he's done to save Hope. Mm -hmm. That's why she can't kill him. Right. But, okay, that's it. Yeah. You anything else? I swear, Mama. I feel like all our discussions is just me saying stuff and you saying, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, unless, honestly, unless it's dark. Otherwise, <laughs> everything else, I just feel like, yeah, you're like, yeah, and I'm just like, I recount and stuff, so. Okay, Doki, that's kind of it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed our reaction to this episode. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. And uh, if you want to watch our full-length reaction to this episode, you can find it on my Patreon. And remember, Sunny Mert, Jessica would hate this shirt. I swear I'm sober because she drinks so much. Yeah. <laughs> She's definitely not sober. But, oh, my God, Jessica, she'd wear this. Um, this she'd wear this ironically. Right. If this were in black, she'd wear it ironically. Yeah. Um, while she's drinking, chugging back, yeah, whatever, any type of alcohol, alcohol, because I feel like she'll drink whatever. Okay, okay, you know, yeah. So that, so if you want any new merch, it's linked to in the description box, this to the store. And yeah, you have a beautiful day. See you. Night.